hello uh, welcome to our video tutorial in this video tutorial we are going to develop a simple currency converter uh, so what we will do is we will have a form and uh, we will provide the currency options in a combo box for now we will have USD and UK pound okay so the starting point will be Ethiopian bur so after selecting uh, we are going to enter amount mm, sorry amount will be entered in this text box and then we'll have a button to convert so when I click or when the user clicks convert button will show a J option uh, message box so let's create our project file new project Java effects in swing next so the project name will be currency converter finish okay now we have an empty project let's right click and add new j frame form we call the class or the file name converter so we'll have an empty form there we go this is our form so in this our design uh, will design <coughs> our application so here is the label which uh, describes a combo box okay so this is the combo box and after that uh, I'll have a text box here to enter amount and of course level should be here to describe what the text is about and finally we will have a convert button so label text of the first level should be uh, convert to because I'm going to select options from the combo box so let's change variable name for the combo box it's going to be cbo combo box uh, convert to okay or cbo cur cur currency type we can call it and now for the label we only need to change its text amount in Bur, or the standard code is ETB, Ethiopian Bur. So the, I will provide amount in Ethiopian Bur and it will convert it to USD or UK, where UK pound. So let's change the text box properties. Text amount in Bur and its text should be empty. Let's go for button BTN calculate uh, or we can call it btn convert of course now its text should be convert now let's run and see our design first before we jump into code because there are a few things we have to adjust okay it's been compiled here we go now in convert to we have four options but these are not the options I want okay so we have to change this we have to change the list to the lists I want USD and UK pound so select combo box and here on the model field click on the browse button so here is the list so just remove the list and we can insert 
our own list here okay so when we see our form it's going to be convert to we will have two options okay now we can jump into code right click on convert button events now i want mouse click event event so mouse mouse click event so in here automatically netbeans will out uh, will generate a function with the name btn convert mouse clicked so here what i should do is first i need to capture the amount in bar in variable so int let's consider it as integer amount in bar integer value of from txt amount in bar text box so dot get text so here i have the amount to be converted now what i should know is where to convert it to convert it to usd or convert it to uh, uk pound so here we need to make a decision so first let's get the selected index the selected index from the combo box the combo box is cbo convert to dot get selected index selected index will be zero for the first option and one for the second option it keeps on uh, counting so now we are going to implement another option of a conditional statement which is called a switch so now we'll see how to implement switch of a switch statement to implement a switch we call switch and on the switch statement the switching criteria is selected index okay so the switch criteria is selected index now i need to check <clears throat> if selected index is one or selected index is zero or two will uh, it depends on how cbo convert to is handled in uh, java so the syntax is now there are multiple cases in a switch so the first one is case case zero which means when selected index value is zero so when selected value is zero what i'm supposed to do is let's declare integer value because the we are going to round up the result so we can make it through the integer so result and when selected index is zero which means usd so i'm supposed to so i'm supposed to convert amount in birth to dollar so usd dollar so we should divide it by 28 based on the current uh, exchange uh, result so now i have to show the result j option pen let's import that it's imported j option pen now j option pen dots show message dialog the first parameter is none the second parameter is the input so what i'm saying is converted amount is now i'll draw result so result variable will be concatenated with converted amount string okay so after we finish our first case we have to write break which means our first case is completed so get out of get out of the switch block so to continue our case so now we'll do case one which means selected index is one so in this case amount will be divided into 35 for 36 kind 
so now what the problem is as you can see in a switch statement the scope is it starts here and ends here so in between it's all the same scope which means i can't create int result twice so what i simply can do is cancel int by int uh, in a keyword here which means i declared result variable here and reuse it here too it's not a problem now i'll have a default value default value means if the selected index is other than zero and one so in that case i would say invalid selection please try again there you go let's try let's try our application now okay here is the, our application now usd let's give it 10000 and when i click convert converted amount is 357 the decimal points will be cut off because we are using an integer variable okay let's see 10000 for uk pound convert so the converted amount is 285 so we're finished with our currency converter application so in this application we uh, we saw how to implement a switch statement and also how to read selected value from a combo box so this is what we have for this video uh, thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe to our channel for future videos uh, also please write your comment about the video below in the comment section thank you very much